living through the storms, living through the extreme heat, uh, living through some of the flooding, being able to see um, what the flooding had done, especially in like Tulare County, um, it really gave me the sense of knowing that at the end of the day, you never know when something is gonna happen. And you may think that you have everything together, but when it's time for the rubber to meet the road, uh, the biggest challenge is making sure that um, we had things pl in place and ready to go when they happen. So. <laughs> At least those California is important to our community because it prepares our community, it prepares um, the, the population which we service. When we think about people of color and the uh, BIPOC pop, uh, population, it allows us to be able uh, to get um, those individuals really prepared. It gets hot here and we've got our wildfires. It's scary, you know, I, I personally have been responded to multiple wildfires in California and outside and it's always the same thing, you know, just wildfires happen and like within two hours you could get evacuated from your home. Where I live at, the fire literally went around like a no horseshoe and it went all the way around us. Thousands have been forced to flee. And then you're away from your home for what could be weeks or months at a time and not know what the status of your home is. So be able to provide that kind of level of comfort to know that there's an organization that's helping do structure protection on your home that you had left behind in a hurry. Um, help put people at ease, you know? How Listos is helping us is really by allowing us to get the word out, you know, in various languages, English, Spanish, there's so many wonderful materials and resources that get out to community members. And there's been so many times, especially from the Hispanic community, that they've come to our table to learn a little bit more, that we handed out one of these resources, walked them through it, um, and they're saying this is invaluable. We helped uh, get homes prepared for evacuation, so homes that needed help uh, reducing fuels in their area um, that were very fire hazardous, that were about to be evacuated. We sent people in, uh, contractors, to trim everything down, build defensible space around the structure. So if a fire did um, get to their home, it'd have a higher chance of survival. When the TOPS fire happened in um, in Napa County, I was, I was evacuated. We were not prepared. We were not prepared. We didn't know. We, were, we didn't have the, you know, a go bag, which is something really uh, easy to put together, but we didn't have anything. So when we left our house and we abandoned our, you know, our pets, when we abandoned our possessions, uh, we start, you know, we, we knew that we need, at some point we were going to start again, you know, from the very beginning, you know, building our house, bu building our lives together again. And I think that's what helped me realize how important the emergency preparedness is, that we must be ready. The Listos California grant is, make, is making uh, possible for us to reach out to the most vulnerable communities, the most isolated communities. Without the funding, we will not be able to help our community members um, get prepared um, and find those resources that are necessary for them to survive.